Hello, good evening. How are you all doing today? Hope you're having a great time wherever you are in the world. Uh, today we're going to be reacting to Itzy Bet On Me. I've never heard anything from Itzy before. I'm really excited to have a listen, see what I think, and yeah, just see what sort of stuff Itzy does. So uh, come along with me and let's have a listen, shall we? Let's do it. Loving the look in the video already. Really uh, cinematic with the orange and teal. She's got a cute voice. She's got a really nice voice. Nice and soft. She's a cute pickle, isn't she? She's got a lovely little face. Really nice voice as well. What a nice track. Really loving this so far. Loving that sound. That takes me back to the 90s uh, sort of trance sort of days. You know, when all the trance music was massive, like uh, BBE, Seven Days in One Week. If you've not heard that, that's, that's what the bass is like. It's like this. It's a, it's a square wave, basically. Um, yeah, love it. Really like it, actually. Like in the horns as well, the little horn stabs. Mm. Are coming in. She's got a nice flow as well. Really liking this track. I'm really liking it. It's um, it, it's weird. Uh, this track does something that a lot of songs normally don't do. Okay, so when you've kind of got a track and you build and you build and you build and you build and it gets to the chorus, the chorus normally builds again and it's quite big and you have the whole big chorus, you know, loads of sounds going on and then it goes back down again for the for the verses. I noticed on this with the chorus, when it gets to the chorus, it strips out completely and you just get that derp, 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 derp sort of sound. Really rare that happens. Off the top of my head, the only time I can think of that happening, Katy Perry, I Kissed a Girl, that does the same thing. It builds and builds and builds and builds. And when it gets to the chorus, it actually strips right back, really, really back. And you only get a couple of elements. It's a really interesting way of doing things. It's also very difficult to do, but this is this has done it excellently. When it comes on again, I'll show you what I mean. Shot incredibly well, the video as well. Really well done. Loving the use of synths. Not overdone. Really well used. See? The track strips straight down. It's just a kick and the bass. Dub, 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 dub. Okay, so it is completely new to me. So if you've got any recommendations of more itty things to listen to and react to, please, please get on the old keyboard. Uh, yeah, comment down below. Let me know what I should be listening to because this, this is really good. I want to hear some more. That's a great shot. That was excellent. That was. Let's go back there. The lighting on that shot. Look at that. That looks superb. Really well done. Looks a bit like Ghost in the Shell. Oh, bless her. Now they're all running. They're all going to be knackered when they get where they're going. Oh, 
Okay, so that was Itzy, Bet On Me. It's the first time I've heard any Itzy tracks at all. Um, I really liked it. I liked it a lot. I thought the sounds that were used were superb. I thought nothing was overdone. Um, I thought the girls' voices were great. Um, obviously all really pretty. Um, just just excellent. Really good, solid girl band, uh, girl group track. Um, I liked the bass. It sounded like an old trance track. BBE, Seven Days in One Week. Uh, BBG, Snappiness. Um, that sort of stuff. If you have a little, a little, you know, Google or look on YouTube, you'll see what I mean with the sounds. It's basically a square wave hit on the off time instead of a hi hat. House music's normally with a hi hat. Trance music was different. They did a kick and then bass like that. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know I've got problems, but um, really interesting, great track. Glad to listen to it. Please recommend some more of this stuff. I'd really like to get to know some of their other music and see what it's like. But um, yeah. Thank you for spending some time with me while I react to uh, Itsy Bet On Me. I've really enjoyed it. I hope you have too. If you did, like, comment and subscribe. If you didn't, like, comment and subscribe and then come back and see me, see whether I've listened to you and learnt. It's what we're all here to do, isn't it, really? But um, yeah, thanks for spending time with me. I love your face. Bye.